Did you know that the state of North Carolina saw an increase in population of 10% between 2010 and 2020? For reference, the U.S. population increased by only 7.4% in the same period. What's more, the cities of Raleigh and Charlotte are currently some of the fastest growing metro areas in the entire country. But what's the reason behind this growth? Well, today on Across the Globe, we're going to look at the 10 reasons everyone is moving to North Carolina. Number 1. Low Cost of Living if you're like the average American, you've probably been stressed about the increasing cost of living. In fact, 67% of Americans report feeling concerned about this. The reasons for this are pretty clear. Food, for instance, has increased the most since 1979, and energy has increased exponentially. What's more, although inflation has seen a drop as of late, it was still 8.58% last year. In the face of rising costs of living, however, North Carolina stands out as an outlier. In fact, North Carolina has one of the lower costs of living in the U.S. with an index of 96.1. For reference, the most expensive state in the country is Hawaii, which has a cost of living index of 179. Most of the reason for this has to do with housing, as North Carolina has some of the more affordable housing in the U.S. Number 2. Strong Economy For those concerned about inflation and a rising cost of living, they may be more likely to move to a place with a strong economy, and North Carolina fits that description. For starters, its economy is fairly diverse. The state has industries ranging from agriculture to finance to tech, and major Fortune 500 companies like Bank of America, Lowe's, and Honeywell International are positioned there. As a result, its diverse economy means that it's more resilient when things get tough elsewhere. This may be one of the reasons that U.S. News & World Report ranked it the 14th best state in terms of the strength of its economy according to factors like its business environment, labor market, and economic growth. Specifically, it ranked 15 in terms of its business environment, 22 for employment, and 14 for growth. And North Carolina's growth was pretty impressive, seeing a 1.2% job growth. For reference, the state with one of the lowest ranked economies, Louisiana, reported a 0.1% job growth. Number 3. Campaigns While facts like a low cost of living and strong economy might be enough to persuade people to move to North Carolina, others may have been drawn there because of advertising. You heard that right. The state has launched a robust advertising campaign in recent years that's aimed at recruiting people and businesses to the state. Maybe you've even witnessed some of these ads yourself while listening to a podcast or watching a video online. This campaign launched back in 2021 under the Economic Development Partnership of North Carolina. It was started in response to the pandemic, with the campaign being an attempt to bring jobs and tax dollars to the state as a part of North Carolina's pandemic recovery plan. And the campaign isn't small. All in, the state has spent $2 million on advertising. Number 4. Cost of Housing Another factor that may be pulling people to North Carolina and contributing to its significant population growth is the affordable cost of living. According to Redfin, for instance, the median sale of a home across all of North Carolina was a little over $370,000 as of May 2023. Compare that to the national median sale, which was $418,000 in the same time period, and it's pretty clear how much more affordable North Carolina real estate can be. But it's not just May that saw better numbers for North Carolina. This has been a consistent theme for the state. For instance, Wise Voter ranked North Carolina number 26 in terms of the best states to buy a home, citing its median home price of about $360,000. The most expensive states for reference are California, with a median home price of over $843,000, and Hawaii, with a median home price of about $716,000. The good news continues for those who rent. North Carolina ranked number 17 in terms of best states to rent in, 
with a median rent for a one-bedroom of $988 and an average of 29.4% of income going to rent. That's below the national average of $1,085 for a one-bedroom and well below the most expensive state to rent in, California, where the median rent for a one-bedroom is $1,698. Number 5. Atmosphere According to one report, people are increasingly looking to move to areas with lots of open space, and North Carolina offers that, especially for those moving from more dense states. Recently, 30% of all those who searched online about moving to North Carolina were from California, Florida, and New York, states that are significantly more dense than North Carolina. For instance, the population density of North Carolina is about 217 people per square mile. California is 251 people per square mile, Florida is 406, and New York is 420, almost double North Carolina's. Another reason people are moving to North Carolina is for the weather, as people are seeking out states with more mild temperatures. Averages across the state range from 60 to 66, depending on where you are, and residents here enjoy mild winters and balmy summers. Essentially, you get four seasons without the extreme temperature swings that some other states have. Number 6. Quality of Education For those with children, moving somewhere with good quality public schools has become more important now than ever. That's because the quality of public schools nationwide has been declining. For instance, a new report showed that math and reading scores recently plummeted to the worst levels in decades. Those moving to North Carolina may not have to worry about these issues, though, and that might be another draw for those who are moving there. According to U.S. News & World Report, North Carolina is number 16 in the country in terms of both its higher education and quality of public schools grades kindergarten through 12th grade. The state's average high school graduation, for instance, is 87.6%. For reference, the state with the lowest education ranking, New Mexico, has an average high school graduation rate of 76.9%, over 10% lower than North Carolina's. Number 7. Happiness I'll preface this by saying that happiness rankings are likely not the main reason people are moving here. However, if you visit a place and people seem genuinely happy, it may be an additional factor that pushes your decision over the edge. And North Carolina, according to a study by WalletHub, is one of the happier states in the country, recently ranked number 20. To determine the rankings, WalletHub ranked each state according to factors like emotional and physical well-being, which includes career well-being, physical health, and share of adults with depression. Work environment, which includes the average number of work hours, share of adults worrying about money, and underemployment rate. And finally, community and environment, which includes metrics like volunteer rate, divorce rate, and ideal weather. As I mentioned, North Carolina came out number 20 overall, and notably ranked number 14 when it comes to emotional and physical well-being. I should note that it ranked towards the bottom when it comes to community and environment. However, this wasn't enough to offset its high scores in other areas. Number 8. Retirement Opportunities The number of retirees has seen an increase in recent years. In October 2021, for instance, the number of retirees was 7% higher than the number in January of 2020, equating to about 3.3 million people. And with the cost of living on the rise and climate change impacting some retirees' planning, North Carolina has increasingly been seen as a top retirement destination. Recently, it was ranked as the 12th best state to retire in, according to metrics including affordability, which includes cost of living, tax friendliness, and in-home service cost, quality of life, including social isolation, elderly food insecurity rate, and share of the population ages 65 and above living in poverty, and health care, including physicians per capita, health care facilities per capita, and quality of public hospitals. As I said, North Carolina was 12 overall, 
and was ranked 12, 23, and 35 for affordability, quality of life, and healthcare, respectively. Number 9. Natural Beauty In a movement called the Rural Migration Trend, Americans are increasingly moving to rural areas, showing their wish to be closer to nature. Between 2020 and 2021, rural areas grew by 0.13% compared to a 0.1% increase in urban areas. This might not seem like a huge difference on the surface, but it is when you consider this in the context of migration changes over time. As in the past, urban areas have historically seen more growth than rural ones. While North Carolina isn't completely rural, it has plenty of nature to enjoy. Out of North Carolina's 31.4 million acres, for example, 5 million, or about 16% of these, are public lands. For instance, North Carolina has 41 state parks, 10 national park sites, and 4 national forests, and Thrillist ranked it the 12th most beautiful state in the country, citing its beaches, Blue Ridge Mountains, and incredible Great Smoky Mountains National Park. Number 10. Remote Work Opportunities While North Carolina might have a strong local economy, it's also proven to be a great state for those who are looking to work remotely. And research shows that that's quite a lot of people. For instance, about 14% of people in the country are currently working completely remotely. However, 68% of Americans would prefer to be remote, 100% of the time, and 23% say that they would take a 10% pay cut to work remotely. For these people, North Carolina's remote work infrastructure might be another draw. For instance, WalletHub recently ranked states based on their ability to support remote workers according to two key factors, work environment, which includes the share of workers working from home, internet access, and cybersecurity, and living environment, which includes metrics like the price of electricity, access to low-priced internet, and average home square footage. North Carolina came out number 15 overall, number 16 for work environment, and number 25 for living environment. Another study found that North Carolina has some of the best internet in the country, ranking number 15 according to broadband speed and percent of the state that has internet coverage. What about why people are moving to Virginia, but not West Virginia? Watch this video to learn about that.